Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Tech Motoring. On today's episode, I'm going to be showing you the best floor mats, in my opinion, for the Ford Mustang Mach-E. So hit that subscribe button and stay tuned, because we're coming right back at you. All right, everybody, well, welcome back. So I have what I consider to be the best floor mats for the Mustang Mach-E. And the reason I say so is because I've used this brand, 3D Max Spider floor mats in, well, this will be my third vehicle having these floor mats in. And the reason I like them so much is because not only are they completely durable, but they're also very lightweight. And when it comes to an EV, you definitely want something that is lightweight. Now, other brands out there that make floor mats make them out of basically just a really thick rubber. And the problem with that thick rubber is it's just very heavy and very dense. But what 3D Max Spider does with their floor mats is they make them very lightweight, but they make this top layer extremely durable for all the elements that you can bring to it. And like I said, this is now my third vehicle I'm having these floor mats in, and I absolutely love them. Now let me tell you a little bit about these floor mats. Now I have the front two floor mats and I have the rear one piece floor mat for this car, which I'll be installing and showing you in just a minute. But let me show you a little bit about this mat here. So it snaps into the original pegs that are in your floor. So it doesn't rely just solely on friction to keep itself down. It does have these caps over them so you don't have the pegs sticking up through any type of hole and which also helps because it stops you from getting water through that hole where the peg is sticking through. So it seals off the mat there in case you have any large uh, snow or anything that sits in the bottom of the mat and then melts and then turns into water and then it seeps through those holes anyway. This will prevent that. And on the back here you have what basically is like the hook side of the Velcro where it actually sticks to fabrics or in this case carpet. So this will stick down to the carpet very well and stop it from sliding in any direction. So not only do you have the support of those peg holes from the factory floor mats, but you also have this surface right here, which is great for sticking this down to the floor of the vehicle. So that's why I love these floor mats. Now, I bought these for the Mustang Mach-E. I have a black interior, so that's why I got the black floor mats. But either way, I don't think you could go wrong with black in pretty much any color car, because the black does work well with pretty much any color, in my opinion. But we're gonna go ahead and get these installed. So let me go ahead and grab the floor mats and we'll get these installed in just a minute. All right, so here in the Mach-E, we have a couple things we have to do first, which is take these floor mats out here and look how tiny this floor mat is. I mean, it barely covers anything. Look, look how dirty it is under there already. I gotta really just vacuum that out real quick. So I'm gonna go do that and then we'll come back to looking at this. So here is the driver side floor mat really nice and so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna just take this throw it in here like so and see how it molds underneath the pedals here over this extra look at that look how nice that is that sits in there tuck the tag underneath and then now these should sit right here on this peg let's go ahead and find line it up there we go Look at how nice that looks. Look at that. Full coverage underneath the pedals all the way up to the top of the carpet. It even covers this foot rest over here. That is such a nice fitting mat. Stuck to the floor with not only these pegs, but also with that backing. And this will, this will sit better once it gets hot. It'll form a little bit better to the car. But man, yeah, these things are nice. All right, let's do the passenger side. Okay, well, same process on this side. We're gonna snap up the factory one here. All right, so passenger mat, obviously a lot more simple. Only one peg here that holds onto it. So let's go ahead and just get that tucked in. Like so, look how nice that looks. Black interior 
black floor mats, man, that looks sharp. All right, so I went ahead and cleaned out the carpet, made sure it was vacuumed. I pushed the seats up so we can see these floor mats better. Here comes the back seat. Real cool about having an EV based on an actual EV platform is there's no, there's no hump in the middle. So that's kind of cool, it's a completely flat floor which is good if you have a third passenger. They don't feel like they're sitting on top of that hump. Look how deep that tray goes underneath that seat. That is awesome. And of course, this doesn't have any type of pegs because you don't need to hold this down. I mean, it's wedged between, you know, the back, the sides. All right, everybody. Well, thank you very much for watching. I don't think there's any concern whatsoever about the fit and finish of the 3D Max Spider floor mats for your Mustang Mach-E. Get rid of these factory chintzy just almost useless carpeted floor mats it's about time you get those out of your car and get into a nice pair of those 3d max spider floor mats well everybody i'd like to thank you very much for watching today's episode don't forget to hit the thumbs up just below please subscribe to the channel if you are number one an ev enthusiast number two a mock e owner because i'm gonna be doing a lot more videos on this in the future Take a look at our website, techmotoring.com, facebook.com slash techmotoring. Follow us on Twitter, at techmotoring. I'd like to thank you again very much for watching today's episode. And remember, welcome to the future and welcome to Tech Motoring. And we'll see you on the next episode.